Hey, what's up YouTube? Welcome to the Lace Up channel. Today I'm going to show you how you're gonna be able to eliminate 100% of your manual order entry into your accounting system. In this demo, I'm gonna be showing you how your sales reps can take an order from their smartphone and send that order straight in to your back office so that no one has to put them in by hand. The first step is to take your smartphone and open up the Lace Up app. When you open up the app, the first thing that you'll see is a list of the customers that your sales rep will be visiting on that day. To begin creating an order, we're gonna tap on the customer. On top, you'll see the customer details. Below, you'll see all the open invoices. To begin creating an order, we go to Menu, Sales, Order. Now there are four ways to add product to an order in LaceUp. The first way is to work off the history for that customer. LaceUp will automatically generate a template based off of the order history for each customer. If you look, this template shows you the product name, the last date you sold it to the customer, the last quantity sold, and the last price. Here's your on hand in your warehouse, your average sales per visit, and the current price in the accounting system. To add product, you tap the plus symbol, you hit the quantity, you hit OK. The second way to add product to an order is with the use of a scanner like this one. So you're going to take the scanner, point it at the product, and scan. The moment you do so, the quantity on the line will increment. Let's do it again. I just scanned it twice. Scan it a third time a fourth, and a fifth. So I've shown you how to create or add product from the template and how to scan it to add to the order. Next, I'm gonna show you how to use the catalog. We're gonna to go to cats. We're gonna select a category. Here are all the product images for my items. To add product from the catalog, I hit the quantity. I hit okay and I scroll down the list. Quantity, amount, okay. When I'm done, I tap add items. The last way to add product to an order is to search for it. We're gonna go ahead and search. And here the behavior is exactly the same. We'll go down the list and add a few of each product. Three of these, two of these, four of these. When I'm done, I tap add items again. Here are all the products I've added to the order. When I'm done creating the order in the field, with the tap of one button, I'm gonna send this order from my device to the office so it can be picked, packed, and delivered to the customer. I'm gonna tap send order, yes. Order sent. Now in the back office, you'll open up this window. In this window, there is a process orders button that's gonna show you every order that's pending. Here's the order we just created, and when we double click, we'll see its details. The very first step is to print the pick ticket for this order. This pick, it, pick ticket is utilized to pick, pack, and prepare the product for delivery in the back office. If you look, here's the product that was ordered, and here's the quantity to be picked. Once we're done picking, packing, and preparing the product for delivery, we're gonna go ahead and export this order to our accounting system. To do so, we select the order, and we click send to export. Next we click export orders. 
And the final step is to click export documents. That's going to send all the documents in this window to your accounting system. Compatible accounting systems include SAP Business One, Microsoft Dynamics, Navision, or Great Plans, Sage 50 or Sage 100, and most importantly, QuickBooks Desktop or QuickBooks Online. Now for more information on the Laceup order taking software, visit our website down below or call us. For daily videos, subscribe to our channel today and we'll see you next video. Thank you.